Hey everyone, so today's video is going to be an unboxing of January's Palette Full Packs box. Let's see what we got. Acrylic paint says here on this. Let's just move it to the side so we can look at everything one by one. So straight away I see a canvas masterpiece museum wrap drum tight stretch staple free edges wood from u.s sustainable forest restretched on same size frame professional quality and it's called vincent pro three times one time size two time primer Hmm. So that'll be fun to try out. And the size of this is... Am I not seeing it? 5x7. Alright. We have this. Came out the plastic catalyst so I'm guessing it's like a scraper it's by Princeton's Princeton art artist brush company hmm. here's another scraper and it's got these beveled edges make cool textures in your paint I guess and there's a ton of looks like paint so here's heavy gel matte by golden that's gonna be cool to try out light molding paste and these are two full ounces There's four tubes of golden artist color. I'm guessing that they're acrylic paints. They're 3.4 full ounces. So it seems like they gave us our three primaries. Hands of yellow medium. Ultramarine blue. Naphthol red light and then a white titanium white so that's cool you can make a lot of colors out of those primaries and last but not least a paintbrush by Princeton and it's the same brand as these scrapers I guess you would call them and this is a size 4 And that's everything that came in that box. Let's read this. January box acrylic paint. Golden heavy body acrylic. These are 100% acrylic smooth thick colors are offered in a large assortment of unique pure pigments there are no fillers extenders opacifiers toners or dyes added they render excellent permanency and light fastness each color is formulated differently depending on the nature of the pigment then we have golden light molding paste which are one of these tubes Light molding paste can be used to achieve a variety of effects and expressions. When used in conjunction with acrylic colors, they broaden 
working properties and expand creative possibilities. Light molding paste dries to an opaque matte finish with good flexibility. It is designed to hold stiff peaks for highly textured surfaces and it blends easily with colors. So this is going to be cool to try because I've never tried it before. But I am familiar with acrylic paint. And Golden is a really good brand. Um, Golden Heavy Gel Matte. Gel mediums offer many ways to build texture. They can be used to create glazes, extend paint, and change finishes. Gels are essentially colorless paint as they utilize the same 100% acrylic polymers as acrylic paint. Gels are also excellent adhesives for collage and mixed media. They dry with excellent flexibility with chemical, water, and UV resistance. So to the Princeton Catalyst Bristle Brush. These synthetic bristle brushes have individual hairs that have been split to replicate the natural flags on the finest natural brush. Designed for use with heavy bodied acrylics, these short handled brushes are ideal for use with heavy mediums, gels, and paste. So now the contour tools, which are these two. Create fun and interesting textures with these contour tools. They are heat resistant, solvent resistant, and dishwasher safe. And then the canvas, I'm not going to read that because I just read all that stuff on the actual canvas. But it's like a gallery, a professional quality, You, I guess you would say, um, canvas. So yeah, guys, that's everything for this box for January. Um, it's a pretty cool box. I don't know. I really, I haven't uploaded a video for November or December's box because I really did not like November's. And I don't know what happened with December's. I just didn't upload it yet. I don't know if I'm going to continue to order with Palafull Packs and it's not that... You know, um, I'm not happy with the products that they're sending me because I think that they're really good products and I do recommend it to anyone who is really into art supplies and it's so fun to get a package and not know what's in there. And it's really cool to get things that you wouldn't normally buy. But I just personally feel like I could be using that money every month to get exactly what it is that I want versus getting... um a pack getting something and really only liking a couple of the items but I don't know maybe I'll stick with it another month but we'll see so I'll probably do a time lapse of what we'll paint here and I'll see you guys back in a little while one thing that they could have included I think would have been maybe like a palette for the paints or maybe like some palette paper would have been cool. Um, they usually are really good for giving you some really good surfaces to work on. So I'm a little disappointed if they only sent one canvas. You know, they're really good for like sending a notepad of sketch paper or whatever kind of paper. They're usually good for that. So yeah. I don't know. These are my thoughts. My first thoughts from opening this box. I also love the fact that they sent these primaries because it will help me practice with mixing colors from primaries. I know like the, you know, the gist of it. Red and yellow make orange, blue and red make purple, blah, blah, blah. But it would be cool to test myself to make other colors.
All right, guys, so this is the finished product. It's still wet, though, so I have to let it dry. I feel like it's so dark. Um, maybe that's a little better. But you guys can probably see the texture. So, I love these two mediums. So, first off, the light molding paste. This is my first time ever using it. And I use that here on the middle of the flowers. And it was just really so cool. Like you can use it to get some really nice texture. And you can really see it like when I turn it on the side. So I'm gonna let that dry and I'll probably like add a couple more layers. But I just wanted to tell you guys what I thought of it. Um, it felt when you mix it with the paint, it doesn't it won't really affect your color like I was using it on the yellow it didn't make it any lighter even though it looks white um, when I mixed it it immediately made it very like fluffy and moussey I guess you would say and I just used the brush and like kind of like slapped it on and dabbed it to make like little peaks um, the heavy gel matte I really like this too like I could see this making your paints go like a really long way um when I was mixing these coral colors excuse my palette guys I really like to build up the colors like that and peel it off <laughs> I don't know why it's really satisfying but I only have like a little bit of paint left and so I was, I forgot how, I mean, I didn't know what this does. So I had to remind myself. So I reread the description. And so I just poured some on it because it said that it, um, uh, it extend, it extend your paint. So I put a little bit on where, like I barely had a little bit of paint and it seriously does extend your paint like a little bit. I just had like a really light layer and it gave me like basically like a really thick consistency like a really nice amount of paint so I could see this making your extent help you extend your paints for like a really long time um, and I use everything in this kit except for this one I probably could use it on the background but I didn't I used this scraper to kind of get some texture in the petals I don't know if you guys can really see that but I'm gonna let this dry and I'm probably gonna play with it and boost up like the values a little more and add like little details this brush was even really nice um it's a pretty decent brush and yeah, that's about it. So I think that this is, I, I really love this box. At first I wasn't, I'm not going to lie, I wasn't too happy, excited about it. But now that I'm using the products, I'm so happy that I tried these. Because this is something new that I've never tried before. And that I will probably buy again if, you know, I run through these. I think this is the perfect size to like try it out and see how you like it. I do have some golden fluid the fluid on paints I've never tried these and I really like them um, they're a really nice thick consistency I usually use like the Liquitex basics and I really love those too I mean those are the only ones I use so I really don't have anything to compare it too much to but these I hear that golden is like really expensive because they're like the best or whatever I don't know, but these are, I think that these are going to last me a little, will go a long way, especially with the gel, the heavy gel mat. So yeah, guys, that's about it for this um, January Palafel Packs review unboxing. And yeah, so I think I'm going to keep Palafel Packs for another month because I don't know, I really like this box. I'm not going to lie. All right, guys. So make sure that you subscribe. Um, you guys can follow me on Instagram. I'll probably post. If I don't add it to this video, 
I'll probably post a finished picture painting of this. Um, you guys can follow me on Instagram. My username here, which is Poochie, P-U-C-H-Y, underscore Tats, T-A-T-S, on Instagram. So, all right, guys, I'll see you guys next time. Have a great one.